वेलकम टू डिजाइन कोच टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट साइड बार मेनू हाउ टू डिजाइन अ साइड बार मेनू फॉर योर डैशबोर्ड यूआई सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट साइड बार डिजाइन इन फिगमा यूआई आर यू विजिटिंग फर्स्ट टाइम माय चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब टू माय चैनल एंड लर्न हाउ टू यूआई डिजाइन इन फिगमा सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द साइड बार मेनू इन फिगमा here is my figma ui kit and in this ui i design all the ui designs of bootstrap so first what elements we need to design for our sidebar menu we need first nav item normal hover and active so this our first nav item i just go and change the color of it heading color okay now this our first nav item i go to and convert it into auto layout in auto layout we got this spacing for now we don't need space this and padding we need for 12 pixels 16 from left right oh 16 okay so this element we need for our nav item i just go and give the name nav item okay now i just go and change the color of it for so purpose so i can see see this our first element of nav item i just go and give it randomly space 200 pixels okay so this our first nav item but in the sidebar we need icon also i just go here here is the five icons for nav sidebar i just downloaded this icon from bootstrap icons so you can just go here and search and you can download icon as you need i downloaded this icon and i just go to here before i use this icon i need to convert this icon into first component i just go here and change it color for now dark i just select all and color for our ui use okay now i just go here rename it convert into icon so this icon converted again i go to here and convert this all icon into component convert and convert now what i need to do i just need to do this icon add instance add need to add into nav sidebar see now we need to space between this text and icon i just go here and give the space 12 pixels it's a too much so i can just use 8 pixels space between two item now i just go here and make it radius 4 pixels 4 pixels radius so this become our first nav item normal now i need to convert this nav item normal into component so this our first sidebar element now again i just drag it and duplicate it with control and i just use nav item over just go here and i change the color randomly over color this okay and i just renaming it normal to over now this item we need to convert in component again i go to here and create component duplicating again i this normal and now we need to a uh, active element for our sidebar name i just rename it and give the name active new item active i just go here and new item active no enter here okay so these three are our first element again i need to active into convert into create component so this we need to active so i just go here change the color or on side i just select background color convert okay and the text color we need to be a white as we see in the sidebar design see you can see here 
the side effect is active here is the non normal state but we create for our purpose so these three element we need to required in our sidebar element i just go here and change the color of it so we can use it carefully okay so this our three elements we need to uh, required for our sidebar design now i just select this nav item normal and duplicate it again i duplicate it and for this we need to use one frame so i just create one frame call it sidebar okay now convert this frame into auto layout after convert this you see one normal item in the sidebar nav i just go here and give it padding 12 pixels for the visual purpose i just give the background color here okay so this our first item in sidebar now i just go and give the name of this sidebar home first i give the name of home again i need to duplicate this a uh, element for our another nav item command d or you can use control d see we need total five elements for our sidebar dashboard i just go and change the name dashboard orders products and customers now we need to change icon of the nav item i just go here and search here see you will find all the your icons in the here now for this we need a dashboard icon you just replace it because you created it as a component so it will be replaced easily now i go to here order in order icon we need table just go and name it table again go it and select grid the grid icon for product customer icon we need use profile circle see this very initial of nav item with sidebar now i just select one active i just go here nav item normal to active see now this convert into active item now you see there are we five items and now i will to manage space so you can extend this sidebar long as you want now managing space between sidebar here is the space you can see check it here you can give as your requirement for now i just use 8 pixel space between each element if you see there are no space too much in the between so i can just use 4 pixels in between if you looking for this here is the pure white background and no background color in nav item so i just go here and change the color of it white and now just for visual purpose i just give it stroke see here is your sidebar design four pixels it is i just give for purpose now you need to create a logo for your sidebar i just go here and side bar i convert this into auto layout and give it space 16 pixels no need between space there are too much we just give 12 and 12 i just drag into side bar here i just 20 pixels font size of side bar i just drag it to here now i need to need a divider here just i select one line give it name divider and can select this divider color light i convert this divider into auto layout dy i just name it dy there and no need space between and no need space to 
now I just convert this into divider use instance of it into between this sidebar I just drag it into between this here is a knot I just select this just go to delete select this and we need to put this divider into sidebar logo between so just duplicate this I just drag by control and you can see you can see the divider is here now just I put into up C now you need to space between total logo with divider I just select both these and convert into auto layout this group is logo okay now this is our nav item creating one group for the frame for nav item nav items if you see there are two space i just need to convert into 16 pixel space see here is the your space between logo and nav items and inner nav item have a space 4 pixels so this now i need to just change the width of this item i just go to here and change the width of this you see it's not responsive so just i go into nav item first nav item you see here is the fix we need to fill container the all we need to convert them into so i just go here and select this nav item open the normal nav item we need to fill container here also we need to convert this into fill oh, no sorry fill container normal item also we need to fill container now here is the very initial level of our sidebar design in figma so if you visiting first time my channel please subscribe to my channel and also like my videos thank you for watching my ui design in figma